This is the weekly reading for Pisces. Weekly reading for Pisces. This is my new deck. I got this one and this Oracle deck over here. Okay. Pisces. Weekly read for Pisces. Eight of Wands. Fast communication. Why is Eight of Wands here? The Tower. Wow. Okay. The Tower. Something fell apart here. Why is the Tower here? I'm getting what all glitter, glitter doesn't shine. Something like that. Somebody thought that Somebody could have thought that somebody had changed and they didn't. Um, I say that because butterflies represent represent transformation and the butterflies are actually being struck by lightning. So I feel like there's some kind of communication around somebody's changing, but they didn't really change. Um, this person could be a snake. <clears throat> this person could have had a lot of partners. This person could have had addictions. Why is Seven of Cups here? Page of Wands. Somebody could have caught somebody making an offer to somebody else. Why is Page of Wands here? Ten of Pentacles. Could have been with an earth sign. Ten of Pentacles. Could have been some kind of communication with an earth sign. Why is Ten of Pentacles here? King of Pentacles. Mm. This person could have earth in their chart. This person is married. Could be your husband or your committed partner. Could identify as a wolf or spirit animal as a wolf. I don't know. Older. Um, could have been an older gentleman. Why is King of Pentacles here? The wheel. Yeah, this this is um Somebody could have dice hanging up in their rear view mirror. Um, or somebody could like playing, playing poker or something like that. But um, yeah, the wheel here is this is moving in the right direction. This is spirit taking the wheel. I feel like this person got caught because the universe intervened. Why is the wheel here? Knight of Pentacles. Yeah. He was, it was slow. It, it, it was slow to come out, but it came out. Okay. This person could be controlling. The devil came out, by the way. This person could be controlling... He could be into black magic, doing magic. He could be, for some of you, this isn't for everybody, but he could also be a Satanist. Why is the devil here? Oof. This person could also have white eyes, blue or green. of cups I think he tricked you into believing that 
he was the king of cups but in reality he's the king of pentacles um and what's funny is because the king of pentacles in this deck has a wolf next to him so i feel like this person is a wolf in sheep's clothing um What is the guidance here for Pisces? Two of Pentacles juggling. You're, you need to find balance. Balance. Four of Pentacles. You need to save money. Yeah. Two of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. Wow. This is an escalation of pentacles here. You may have, okay, you're trying to juggle, could be trying to juggle finances here, but you could also, the way I'm reading it, seeing it, is that you could have gone from the two of pentacles to the four of pentacles to now the queen of pentacles. That's also guidance. You need to try and work your way up from the queen of pentacles. Stop trying to juggle this person is very young, right? You could have been doing this your whole marriage. You could have been with this person for a very long time since you were young, right? Juggling your emotions. Then you graduated to the Four of Pentacles, a little bit older, but still not yet graduated, not yet learned your lessons, not yet learned self-worth yet, but getting there. Queen of Pentacles. Wow. That's what Spirit is saying. You could have also tried to hold on to this person very tightly. You could have juggled, had to juggle, you know, emotions. You could have been juggling two people when you first met him. Then when you got together, you, you, um, you know, tried to hold on really tightly to him. And you could have married him. But the guidance here is you need to remember what you've gone through with this person. Two of Swords. There's some kind of stalemate here. Why is the stalemate here? Why is Two of Swords here? you're stuck because you want to walk away but i think you're remembering everything that you've gone through and you don't want to and he's also very controlling he could be trying to control you walking away yeah three of cups i feel like this person wants to have his cake and eat it too <laughs> And you're like, what? I'm a high priestess. And I think you know this, but you're not talking about it. You're acting like you don't see it. You're acting like you don't know that. You don't see it, right? Because her, her eyes are closed. But her eye, there's eyes on top of her eyes that are open. It's like, you know, but you're not telling him. Yeah. Because I think you've done this rodeo with him before. He's reconciled. You guys have reconciled before. Reconciled this before. Right? Oh. And you could have kids together. But you're moving on. You're moving forward. You're like, whatever. Six of Wands. Yep, you're moving forward. You're like, I'm doing me now. Time to do me and focus on me. And this person doesn't like it. He doesn't like that at all. Yeah, he's trying. He's lying. Trying to deceive you. Trying to manipulate you. He could be trying to manipulate you and telling you that you're his twin flame even. Um, I got that because I see the little, um, the 
infinity symbol. That you're spying on him and you know what he's doing. Wow. Seriously? You're going to tell him eventually, Queen of Swords. You're going to tell him eventually. When you're ready to leave, when you have saved up enough money, you're going to tell him. You're going to tell him what you know. You're going to tell him what you know about this Two of Cups. This person could be an air sign. You're going to tell them that you know about those relationships or that relationship. Nine of Swords. It's going to come in fast. He's going to speak his truth too. And this is going to end this. A lot of heartbreak here. A lot of heartbreak, but I feel like it's for the best. Yeah, you're going to be able to grow. You're going to finally be able to grow. I don't feel like you've been able to grow in this relationship. He's like controlled your growth, right? Yeah, he's controlled your growth. Gave you rations of love. He could have even had same-sex affairs behind your back. Um, or you guys could have had same-sex affairs together. But this is all going to come to an end. This is a karmic cycle that is ending. Wow, that was a lot. A lot. We're going to get some messages about this with this one. Messages for Pisces. Messages for Pisces about this situation. Messages for Pisces. Sun, strength, empowerment. Yes. You found your strength and you've empowered yourself. You've become empowered. Autumn harvest here. Integration union. Working towards integration, you're trying to come into union with this person. Um, this person is projecting a lot of things onto you that they see in themselves, right? They're projecting. They're trying to gaslight you. Illusions. Which we've seen that. And it's causing you to be at a crossroads. You're trying to make a decision. Why is decisions here? Why is decisions here? Yep. Decisions for yourself. Water. What new beginning are you going to take? You're trying to have the courage to change. This person is closed off, guarded. He's resisting. Why? Why is he closed off, guarded, and resisting? Wow. Because this is a wish fulfillment. He wants you to leave. He or she could have actually been doing this to get you to leave him or her. Wow. Why is this? Clarify wish fulfillment, please. Memories. He could be thinking of someone else. 
wanting to be with someone else. Why is memory? Clarify memories here, please. Yep. He has a soul tie with someone else that he wants, that he or she wants to reunite with. Why is reunion here, soul ties? What kind of soul tie? He wants to offer them something. He or she wants to offer them something. Why is celebration gifts abundance here? He wants to offer them de deception and temptation. Very toxic person here. I mean, I knew that already, but like, geez, really? You're going to offer, he's going to offer his, <sighs> I know this isn't funny, but oh my God, the audacity. Um, basically everything that he's done to you, he's trying to offer that to somebody else. Wow, bro. Really? And he's going to act like he's gone through a rebirth. What? This could happen by the winter. Receive open. Maybe, um, yeah, it's going to happen by the winter time. I think he's going to feel like this other person is going to be more receiving and open to it by winter. I'm not sure why. Um, in the present moment right now, I think that they're, they feel abundant. They're abundant right now. They could be with somebody else. I saw that. This person may be separate, separating. This person may be, ooh, excuse me, in a separation by winter. So he's going to see them separated and try to come in. Seriously, bro? Yeah, right. He's going to come in when this person is feeling rejected and lost and f feeling a loss and they're going to feel broken. He's going to come in. Unexpected storm. He is definitely an air sign. He or she. Messages, travel, communication. You're going to know that. You're going to know this. Activating higher self. Some kind of messages about them activating their higher self. Growth, summer. Healing inner child. This could be you too doing this. What is the guidance for this person? Well, I already asked that, didn't I? What is the guidance for Pisces? Something flip over. What is the guidance for Pisces with this air sign? Release, surrender, and purge this person. What? Any information about this person? information you guys have a lot of chemistry and passion or you're passionate about this person but yeah who is this person though who is this who is this air sign as a person purpose north node this may I think you may have thought that this person was your purpose at one point in time. Cosmic. Or they could have a purpose. They could have a purpose. They could be a karmic and that's their purpose. Why? Clarify North Node, please. Purpose, please. Ah, no. Clarify the, this air sign's purpose, please. messages dreams they may get messages in their dreams masculine 
Okay, so he's definitely, this person is definitely a twin flame. He's a masculine. And I kept saying he, and, and so I'm going to stick with saying, saying he. This person, or this person could have masculine energy, but this person is definitely a divine masculine. Um, more about this person's purpose. Wow, twin, he's a twin flame. Wow. Um, are they twin flames? Is this Pisces and Libra twin? Whoa. Is this Pisces and Libra a twin flame? What relationship does this Pisces and Libra have? Healing inner child. Okay. You're supposed to be healing their inner child. Y'all are supposed to be healing your inner child together. But what is the what is their relationship though? Forming a solid foundation and structure. Getting rid of belief systems, taking off the masks. Healing wounds. Creating stability and harmony. Completing cycles. And changing. Changing into nurture, nurture and compassion. Wow. So you two might be twin flames. Wow. That's crazy. Comfort zone. Getting out of your comfort zone. This is a very toxic finding self-worth and expectations. This is a very, you guys have a lot of, tra tra you have a hot attraction or very attracted to each other. Remember awakening. Yeah, you guys, wow, this is a very toxic twin flame relationship here. And that makes sense why the projections and reflection, because you guys mirror each other. That's what twin flames do. You marry each other. He's your mask. He is your twin flame. I thought he was lying to you about that, but that's true. Came out. Came out. Wow. But you do have to... Um, you're going to trigger each other and you're going to have conflict and disharmony in their, in their relationship because you're, you know, you're healing. You're going to have a breakthrough and epiphany soon though, but you definitely, I feel like are headed for a separation, which is not uncommon. Um, he can't get his shit together. It seems like, and he can't stop cheating. So you need to explore other opportunities. Like, Wow. What? Okay, let's get some messages. Let's get some messages here. Ah! So it looks like you guys have are going through karmic cycles, but he's not changing or learning. Let your friends help you. Ask your friends for help. Enjoy the bliss of honey holiday time together. So St. Patrick's Day is coming up. Your honeymoon could be coming up. Enjoy that time together. Chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction. Yes, there is because uh, that's came out a lot. <laughs> okay. Flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. More about this Pisces and Libra, please. More about this Pisces and Libra, please. Okay. Whoa. You're married. The situation involves marriage. Yes. Let go of control issues. 
<laughs> release your ex. The time has come to release your energy. Their energy. Clear your energy. Forgiveness and learning. You need to forgive and learn. You need to release him for the time being. This is a past life relationship. You've known each other before. Yes. Because you're tone flames. Um, but you need to separate for a little while. This may cause him to get his stuff together. Express your love. But you're going to have to love yourself first. Okay? You're going to have to love yourself first. I don't think that he's going to change until something drastic happens. And that's just what I'm getting from the reading. This could be, um, and this could be a female with masculine energy. But... I really feel like this is a male. Um, but, yeah. This, I don't feel like this person. God, sorry. I really feel like this person is not going to change unless they have a huge wake-up call. Okay, if you have any other questions, my information is in the description box.